So this is uh, back in Bristol, uh, New Hampshire, and we got all engines up and running. So you're looking down the road. Uh, that was that source engine from Guilford, and he's pumping through 600 feet of four-inch line. You're looking at the Hebron engine on the left, and he has come in and hooked into the Z-valve. If you remember, we started with simply 3,100 feet of four-inch with no pumpers in it. We had deployed a Z-valve in the middle of it, actually two Z-valves and a hydrant valve and uh, that's what's been put in place so the Hebron pumper that's facing us uh, they went online a little bit ago and this Meredith pumper that's facing away from us they were the last to come online uh, basically we did a horseshoe so we're pumping way up the road hard to see but we're pumping way up the road to another pumper way at the top and then pumping back down to this Meredith pumper, this 14 engine 2, and then that pumper is pumping back to that engine that has the headlights on, and that's a thousand gallon a minute pumper. He's the smallest in the system. Total footage of hose is 3,100 feet on the ground, five pumpers. Uh, right now we're in the neighborhood of about 750 gallon a minute sustained. So. Uh, pretty good example of friction loss even in four inch hose over this distance. We'll do another test in a little while. We want to see uh, what that single pumper can do by itself pumping 3,100 feet. Um, until then we had so basically five pumpers, a source and an attack and three relays and that's what's going on. We'll take a look at the Z valve here in a second to see how that looks.